I see the value proposition for logistics real estate in the Netherlands is still really, really good. What we see is that there is still continued demand also from online shopping. We see more and more people since COVID have started ordering online. And with that, there's an additional need for logistics. Also, I see a lot of our customers, they have seen a lot of disruption in the supply chain and they want to, have sh they want to make sure that they have the goods to, uh, uh, to deliver to, our cost to the end consumer. So they're starting to build up a higher inventory level and with that, they need more warehouse space. So we see more and more demand there. At the same time, uh, land is starting to dry up. Construction costs are starting to increase. So it's harder and harder to create new uh, logistics real estate. So with that, we see an upward trend in logistics real estate rents and with that also in logistics real estate values. I do think that with the energy crisis, with a potential recession that we, that we might go into, demand will probably slow down. Um, it's just that supply is still so limited that I think the long-term outlook for the sector is still very, very strong. Yields will soften. I mean, in the end, yields will follow the interest rate, right? And interest rates uh, are rising, have been rising, and we already have seen uh, yields uh, moving up. Um, so that will have you know, a negative impact on, on real estate values. Um, I think what sets us apart a little bit is that we're a long-term holder of our real estate. We, we tend not to sell. So we really look, look at the long-term income potential and there we still feel quite good about the sector.